This summer, we are pleased to announce that we will be migrating my class sites from SharePoint 2007 to the new Microsoft Office 365 environment. This video will explain the migration process and answer many of the questions teachers may have about the upcoming changes. So, when will this migration process start? The My Class migration will begin after the last day of summer school. This will allow teachers to continue to use the current My Class system to distribute information to summer school students and their parents. Only those My Class sites that are currently enabled for public view and have existing documents and links will be migrated to the new Office 365 system. If your My Class site is currently disabled, but you want your site to be migrated, please make sure it is available for public view before the last day of summer school. For each active My Class site a teacher has, a new site will be automatically provisioned in the Office 365 environment. This new site will have all of the functionality of an existing My Class site, plus many new features. All of the existing documents and links will be migrated over to your new My Class site. We will not be moving announcements or calendar entries, as these items are historical and not relevant for a new school year. Please do not add any new announcements or calendar entries for the new school year in your old My Class sites. Today, a My Class site has three areas in which to store documents. During the migration process, these documents will be merged into one area called Course Resources, with subfolders for each of the sections from which they came. This will make it much easier for teachers to manage their documents in the new environment. The links area will remain unchanged. All existing links, descriptions, and categories will be moved over to the new My Class site. Once the migration is complete, teachers will be able to start leveraging the new functionality of their My Class site. This includes a class blog, wiki, picture library, discussion group, class newsfeed, notebook, student hand in folder, and a collaborative documents area. Because the new class sites are collaborative in nature, only certain areas will be publicly viewable by parents. Parents will continue to have public access to content placed in the announcements area, class links section, course resources area, and class calendar entries. Information placed in other areas within the new My Class sites, for example, wiki, newsfeed, and blog, will be viewable only by the teacher who owns the site and those students with whom the teacher has shared. 